So the Jamboree is important because we select five events throughout the season where you can actually fast track two spots for the games. In order to do that, you need to be able to podium at at least two of those events and get a top 16 at the third event. That's what makes these events so important. So if Max wins the Big Air, he will lock up the spot um, through the Big Air selection because he already has two firsts. Mark and Tyler are actually tied in terms of their results for those team spots. For everybody else, they have to wait till January 1st, 2018 to find out if they're going to make the team or not. Any one of these riders could take it. I'm excited to see who it comes out on top. Mark McMorris here. We're here at the Snowboard Jamboree here in Quebec City. Out of the Canadian team here, we have Max Ons Perot, Seb Toots, Mikey Cicerelli, Tyler Nicholson, and myself all battling it out. The cool thing about the Big Air here is it's right in the middle of Quebec City, actually in Old Town, Quebec. And it's just unbelievable how well crafted the scaffolding jump is. It's crazy they can build a jump big enough that somebody can do a triple cork in the middle of a city. We actually changed all the design of the Big Air. It used to be really small in the past, uh, but now since last year, uh, we actually built in run which is larger and the jump is bigger also so we got the biggest jump possible in Quebec City now. It's not only a snowboard contest there's a lot of activities for all the families to come down with their kids and that's what brings a lot of people. The slope sells at Stoneham Resort which is 25 minutes outside of Quebec. It's a series of three jumps into three rails where you just try and get as technical as possible and it makes it a little more frightening to mess up at the end because you're dealing with some really technical rails. I'm just really looking forward to getting into it with all the amazing riders that are here and having fun and seeing who can put down the coolest runs. run I wasn't really thinking about the podium but I knew what people landed so I knew like my run was gonna score pretty well if I put it down clean Mark was sitting first Marcus Cleveland was sitting in second so when I got my score uh, Mark hand up second and then Marcus got third came with a win at home it feels awesome